up it up. Hello, hello. See if anybody joins in. So today's class is going to be a little bit easier than most classes for a, um, it's a low impact class. I'm going to be using a chair. So if you got a chair handy, that'd be great. Um, so we can get started. Um, it's for anybody who's got any mobility issues, bad knees, or you know, is a little bit older and hasn't got as much movement basically. So it's a little bit low key, no jumping around, no getting out of breath so much really. They might get a little bit out of breath. Uh, I'm just gonna take it nice and easy. So you just probably just done Pilates. I'm not saying that was easy, but this is gonna cool you down a little bit probably. Okay, let's get started. So we're gonna start to warm up. So I just wanna start with a, a marching on the spot. Morning, morning Mel. There we go. Everyone's starting to tune in now. It's nice and easy, just nice and easy warm up. Okay, so it's a few seconds to go to this. I'm going to the next exercise. I'm just gonna, oh, just touching the knees. Hey Wayne. Yeah, just making it nice, nice and steady for a Wednesday morning, I wanna say. I've kind of lost track of time now, so. One side to the other. So like I say, this is gonna be a nice and low impact, no jumping around. And on, on in. Uh, what I might do later is film a video of more intense exercise we can do with the chair. We'll post that later though. But for now, let's take it nice and easy. Okay, just wanna rotate the body. Get everything moving. Got another minute to warm up the body a little bit. Just rotate the shoulders. That's it. Four. So I have planned this out, but I might change it as we go along. Just because I want it. Hope you've all got yourself a chair. Just gonna do some toe taps. Or just something to hold on to. Saw this one on the green goddess this morning, so I thought that in. The other leg, stretching out the back of the calves and the hamstrings. Okay, so we're going to actually go into the first exercise in about 10 seconds. So the first proper exercise is going to be just a squat. We're going to use the chair as support. Again, we're just going to go down, keep it nice wide, back nice and flat, back up. Simple, there we go, 30 seconds. And what we can do is as we come up, Make it a little bit more difficult. So, kick out, kick out. I can't do that way because I've got a wall there. So, you just want to concentrate on all the actual movements, not going to any speed. Just nice and easy. That's it. Next exercise, guys. Straight leg kick back. So again, support yourself with the chair. Leg nice and straight, pushing back, pushing your heel down, lifting your foot up, and squeezing the glute, just one leg at a time. That's it. Squeeze that glute. And three, two, one, we're going to change sides, and the other side. That's it. No rest periods in this, we're just going to keep going. Each exercise, 30 seconds. We'll have a lower intensity period in between. Squeezing the glute. Five seconds. Two. One. And back to us marching on the spot. Marching on the spot. Okay. Turn my chair around, take it back. Come on, Louise. There we go. So we're going to sit ourselves down for the next exercise. Just going to take our arms out. Just going to rotate them. 15 seconds forward, 15 seconds back. I want to add some leg movement in as well. You ready? Three, two, one, and forward. Just lift those feet up and down. Again, it's all low impact today. So after all the workouts I've done over the last few days, it's going to be nice. It's nice for me. And back 
stretch, 15 seconds. Keep those arms going, keep them up nice and level with the shoulders. Back up straight. Five seconds. Two, one. Into the next exercise. I'm gonna pull yourself forward a little bit on the chair. We're gonna bend down, take your hands from underneath, and I'm gonna pull back up. So coming in a nice arc motion. So you're going down towards the ground, up the top. So once we're at the top, you want to really squeeze the top of your ear delts at the back and your shoulders. So it's tense those muscles. Okay, five seconds, gonna go for it. Three, two, one, and down, and up. This is a rear delt fly with an upright row. If you do have any weights, any small dumbbells, even a couple of cans or water bottles, you can make it a little bit harder. That's it. 10 seconds left. And so as you're contracting the muscles, this is where we're working. Because we haven't got the weights, just contract the muscles. Next exercise, so lift up with one arm, lift up the other leg, opposite leg. That's it, 30 seconds. Let's go guys, no impact on the knees or the legs at all in this workout. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Five seconds. Okay. In between, chair skips. Pretend you're skipping while you're on the chair. That's it, nice and easy. Keep it going, get a little bit faster. Bounce those feet, up on the toes. Five seconds, and then we're going to go back to the squats. Come back up, into your chair, back round, and back into the squats. Let's go, guys, again. We're going to add the side kick just to make it a little bit harder. I say it's easy, but I'm already sweating. There we go, guys. Keep it going. Two, one, back into straight leg kickback. Work the bum. Wanna keep your heel down and push back. With the straight leg. Fifteen seconds, gonna switch legs. You feel it both your glute you're working and your supportive leg. Five seconds. Back, switch legs. Again, keep it nice and straight. Coming back, really squeezing the bum. There we go. Again, this is for anybody who's got any knee issues or still wants to get a good workout. In 10 seconds. There we go, here we go. Some nice chill music in the background too. Two. One, okay. Get away from the chair, arms up, lift leg to the side. Trying to get that side crunch. Just like that. 15 seconds, keep it going. Right, cheers, Zoe. Are you going to give us a like on the screen if you're enjoying it? Or you're just enjoying me acting like crap? That's it, so march on the spot, march back on the spot. Okay, I'm gonna bring the chair back now. So you're gonna make it a little bit up on the, on the spot. Nine. So, next exercise, come a little bit further forward on the chair, and it's gonna call chair jack. So, like you'd normally do a jumping jack. Gonna stay sat down, and hurry, go up and out. Ready, and go. Hold it, and back. Hold it, and back. 30 seconds. That's it, guys. 
on every one of these moves, I really want to focus on concentrating, contracting the muscle, should I say. Keeping everything tight, keeping your core tight. Okay, so I'm going to bring this around to the side so you can see. Chair dips. Come right to the edge of the chair, fold on either side, and then you're going to scoot your bum a little bit off the edge. And from here, we're going to go down to the tricep dip and back up. Now, if you can't get all the way down, just come part way, just come as far as you can. You'll still feel it in the backs of the arms, you'll still be working those triceps. So 30 seconds, let's go. And if you need to, you can just sit yourself back, have a rest, shake up the arms, and back into it. That's it, guys. About 10 seconds. I feel my triceps working. It's harder than I thought. One, and sit back. Okay, around to the front. Chair twists, very similar to Russian twists. You go straight, you reach down to one side of the chair and over. We'll actually have a nice windmill kind of shape going. If you want to make it a little bit harder, you can take your feet off. Or you can take one foot at a time. So in three seconds, we're going to go. I'm going to go both feet off and go. Over. Down and touch. Again, you want to keep that core contracted at all times. You got it. Back to the chair jacks. Up and out. Up and out. Whee! This feels so strange. That's it. Holding it for a split second. Really working the whole of the body here. Five seconds. Straight back into those dips. The edge of the chair and dip. We've got 15 seconds left. Now work those arms. This low impact. Second three, two, struggling to talk. One. There we go. Chair away now. Next exercise. Again, it's going to work your core. Get you a little bit out of breath. From one side to the other. Just cross body. So high knees, cross body. Come down. So I'm actually bringing my elbow to my knee. Over to my opposite knee, should I say? Okay. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and go. That's jump the gun a little bit there. No bouncing, no jumping. Just really control every movement. Halfway through. And one. Just march it out for me, guys. Dip and reach. So I'm dip and reach, legs apart, back up nice and straight. I'm going to bend, reach to the side. You probably remember these from the 80s aerobics classes. It's all good fun. Yeah, no bouncing. Everything solid, grounded. Are you ready? And dip, reach. And the opposite side. That side. Reach right over. There we go. Keep it going. 
15 seconds. Nearly there. Five seconds left. Two, one. Cool. So you're gonna need to get your chair back now. Or you can use a wall to hang on to. Just gonna use this to stabilize ourselves. We're gonna do single leg deadlift. So, up straight again. I'm gonna take a slight bend in the knee. Just stabilize yourself. I'm gonna take my right leg back. I'm gonna take my left arm down. Like this. And not kick my foot over. Okay guys, let's go. Use the chair for support. If you can't go all the way down, just come part way. If you can, brilliant. Okay, just a slight little bend in the knee. And try not to fall over. Of course, if you do fall over, make sure somebody gets on camera and upload it to the side so we can all have a laugh. One, and then switch sides. So this time, left leg stays, right leg stays down, left leg goes back. Five seconds. Okay, doing well, brilliant. Chair around. I'm gonna use the chair, I'm gonna do some mountain climbers. So just gonna hold onto the chair. Take your feet back. If you can into a straight back. Bring one leg up, one leg back. Pull it through. Again, you can't quite go all the way up to the bend. Just come as far as you can. If you wanna twizzle your bum, you can do that too. Go. 30 seconds. Again, keep your core nice and tight. Cheers, Wayne. I hope you're doing it at home, Wayne. Get your chair out. Woo! 15 seconds. And I can feel this in my core because I'm keeping it really tight the whole way through. Let's take that. Three seconds. Two, one. And come up. Okay, so we're going to go into a butt kicks. Just like this, we're going to add a punch to it. So as the leg comes up, opposite punch. Opposite punch. Just like that. Okay, 10 seconds. We're going to go for it. We're ready. Four, three, two, one, and up. Across. Reach out. Ten seconds left. Five. Two. One. Okay, into a reverse lunge if you can. Again, go back as far as you can with a shoulder age. The back, this will be the full one. If you can't quite do that, just come step back and up. And back with one leg, then we'll go for the other leg. Yeah, start the easier version. Back and back. In five seconds, we're gonna go. Four, three, two, one, and off we go. Up, and reach. Back, and reach. Back. Really extend the body up. And contracting the core as you do it. Woo! We're nearly done, guys, nearly done. Let's just shake it out. March it off. So I hope you enjoyed that. I know it's a little bit more low key than we normally do. And I'll be back to doing my hit tomorrow. 
for me that's, that's a bit of a recovery session and for anybody who's got mobility issues it's still a really great workout. I want to say recovery I'm still sweating. Just take the legs apart, just slightly bend forward for me as far as you can. Just breathe into the stretch. And back up. Again with your legs, take one heel forward, pull the toe back, and just come down as far as you can. Lean into it. Deep breaths. Stay to eat. And up. Then we switch legs. Right heel forward, straight leg. Just lean as far as you can. Deep breaths. Okay, just loosen the shoulders up. Roll them backwards. And forwards. Take one arm across the body. Stretch out the back. Shake it off. Other arm. And back. Okay, guys, that's it. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget, we've got plenty more classes coming later today. Marcus is on for a lot of them, I think, today, actually. So he's going to be tired later. But we'll, I'll see you soon. Take care.